tell you, just take a couple minutes here and let you know some information. And if you want to make an individual donation, you can put it in this envelope up front. And when she gets done, then we'll do the drawing for 50-50. Thank you, Ms. Dunn. Thank you um, to everybody at Midway Music Hall for coming out tonight and supporting St. Baldrick's Foundation and my mother-in-law, Tony Bryant. She was a very special woman. Um, she loved coming here. She loved dancing, even though her body didn't always let her dance. She certainly loved dancing and watching all you guys dance and excellent dancers out here. I think everybody here deserves a round of applause for yourself real quick. <laughs> some great dancers in the house here tonight and so um, to tell you a little bit about the St. Baldrick's Foundation it is um, a childhood cancer research foundation and everyone who participates in their events shaves their head so they shave their head in solidarity with children who lose their hair during their battle with cancer we have this event locally in Winston-Salem every year um, it's the fourth Saturday in September every year we're on our 16th year this year and I am fortunate enough to be the volunteer event coordinator for that event and um, we have raised just our event alone has raised almost eight hundred thousand dollars in the last 16 years um, all of that again goes directly to childhood cancer research and one of the reasons we love the St. Baldrick's Foundation is because you can see your donations come right back into the community uh, Brenner's Children's Hospital has received many many um, grants for research straight to that hospital. So we all know people who have been touched by cancer. Hopefully none of you know children who have been touched by cancer, but it is a wonderful organization and it was Tony's favorite charity. She shaved her head three years ago, three years ago, I believe, right? Not 2019, right before, before COVID. Um, and she, she just jumped right up on stage. She hadn't even planned to do it, but she was called to get up there and and shave her head. She raised eight hundred dollars that day, just just like that. And um, so she really loved this organization, um, and her family does too. Um, her older brother, Uncle Tim Bryan, he's back there at the uh, snack bar. Give him a wave back there. That man shaved his head this year. He raised he raised shoot almost three thousand dollars, I believe. And with um, all of the donations from tonight, um, we're going to be well over our goal this year of fifty thousand dollars, which is generally our goal every year. So we've raised almost fifty. This year, and again, that'll go directly to childhood cancer research. So, we really appreciate everybody coming out. Thank you to Midway Music Hall for hosting us this evening and, um, you know, just doing everything you can to, to raise the money for childhood cancer and to pay honor and memory to Tony, who truly loved being here. This was one of the places she talked about pretty much every weekend, and she was going to be here with her best friend Trish. Trish, wave your hand. Raise your hand. Wait, there's Trish. And she loved coming here with Trish and just watching everybody dance and sometimes getting out there herself and, and cutting her up. So, again, thank you, everybody, and let's see who wins our raffles. Thank you so much, sweetheart. Thank y'all for being here. Let's give Tim another round of applause. He's done a lot of fundraising.